Any any married married people? Give me a woo if you're married. We don't want to do it. <laughs> <laughs> you don't want to. I'm married as well. Yeah, 17 years. Yeah, nothing to wow about it. I never, never wanted to get married. You know, the thought of having sex with that one person for the rest of my life. <gasps> Terrible, right? Absolutely horrendous, yes? Then I reached a stage where I just couldn't be bothered with all that effort that goes into a one-night shag. <laughs> you know, waxing, makeup, holding in the fart. <laughs> you know? <laughs> And sex toys were great, you know. Was, I was having fun. But the girls, they felt neglected. Oh. Yeah, they started crying. They were like, you're being so selfish, bitch. Like, we need some tender, loving care. <laughs> I said, OK. So I married for the girls, just for them. You know, and all my married friends were like, Aarti, you're doing it for the wrong reasons. Sex goes out of the window after marriage. I was like, <laughs> I mean, just look at me. Who wouldn't want a piece of this every single day? <laughs> Feeling horny right now could easily pick one of you, right? I know that. But no, I'm fucking married. So I'll go home with this horny feeling. Look at my husband, you again. <laughs> and the feeling will go away. You know? Sometimes after drinking one or two bottles, I can get over the feeling, put a leg on him. He's got a standard excuse. Oh, not tonight. I've got a headache. Yeah, last night I went in prepared, shoved two Panadol down his throat. I was like, you've got 10 minutes. I'll be back, bitch. Tick tock. <laughs> Panadol did not work. So now I'm on a lookout for roofies. <laughs> With a little bit of Viagra, of course, you know.